Welcome to this instructional video on navigating through CN's true AIGTM suite reports and using the Criteria tab to filter your report data. Power BI is a powerful tool for data analysis. And in this tutorial, we'll guide you through the essential steps to efficiently navigate reports and to make use of filters to focus on the data that helps you solve for your current task. Let's dive in. First, let's open a workspace report in viewer mode, which is the default view upon sign in. On the left side of the report, you'll find the navigation panel. This panel allows you to switch between tabs within the report. Each report tab has a descriptive name relating to its content. For example, bookings history or churn history. In edit mode, which enables report editing capabilities for users with appropriate permissions, the tabs will move to the bottom of the screen and all editing panels will appear on the right-hand side. Another way to navigate the report is through the navigation tab. You see the report structured according to the five GTM suite growth categories. Each category is represented by an icon. And throughout the reports, you will find the icons in the upper right corner of each tab, identifying what growth category it falls into. If a tab has multiple icons, it means that multiple growth categories are represented in that tab. The Criteria tab is a powerful tool for filtering data in your reports. It allows you to slice and dice on various dimensions and focus on specific aspects of your analysis. It's good practice to always start by clicking clear all filters to make sure no filters are selected from previous report use. Setting filters. First of all, select the report period. In this example, we're looking at the strategic report Therefore, we want to set it to span the last few years. Now we'll test a filter combination. These selections will dynamically update all visuals in the report, unless otherwise specified. For example, maybe you want to focus on account executives in the enterprise group. To do so, you simply check the enterprise group in the group filter and check account executive in the user role filter. Throughout the report, you will now only see data for account executives and enterprise group. Selected filter overview. You can easily see if any filters have been selected by looking at the applied filters pane in the criteria tab. Additionally, for a quick view on the selected report period, groups, and user roles, there is a summary at the top of each tab. Quick filters. On certain tabs, there are also quick filters. These filter relevant data on that specific tab only. These filters do not affect the report as a whole. Now you're ready to try it out yourself. By mastering the navigation of your GTM suite reports and effectively filter your data, you'll be able to uncover valuable insights and present your findings with precision and clarity. Happy exploring and analyzing your GTM suite reports. If you have questions or need further clarification on any of these features, please write to us at success at cn.ai.